just finishing up the final touches on this new 50 amp 240 volt. And we, let's see if there's any arc sparks. No, we got lights. All right, prime weld 60. Here's trial at the first stand, TV stand found in shop. Hmm, that's a little rickety. Versus flipping this box over. Much sturdier. I'll be ordering one of those here. So I'm just finishing up um, installing this uh, 240 volt 50 amp for this new Prime Weld 60. Um, plasma cutter so oh no that's not gonna work huh. oh yes it will no it won't this is not the right part i accidentally got the other part anyway it's not gonna be perfect go over a drywall uh, there is no drywall there, so it's just sort of kind of sticking out. I don't know, walkie guy. So. You always see me using these. Well, unfortunately, they gave me these stupid little flathead screws, and my flathead screwdriver is too big, so I've got to go get a different one. So now I just got to plug this in. We're going to see if it works. All right, moment of truth. We're going to see if the breaker is going to. All right, so that's on. We've got power. And we have liftoff. So now I just need to plug in all of the um, tool connectors. This is where the, uh, the ground will go here. That'll uh, connect to the metal. This I'll connect to uh, the, the tool gun, wire feet, the plasma cutter. And then I'll have to hook up air right there. I've got air connected, I've got the tool. I need to put the tip on it. This is not the working tip. Um, here's the ground. Uh, it's not as high quality as my um, Lincoln Electric welder, but it's very tight ground. And this is the air pressure regulator. Supposedly you only wanna have like 55 to, to 80 or 90. PSI. So let's get a piece of metal hooked up and see how it cuts.
So I've got some scrap metal somewhere that I'm gonna try cutting on. You can see I have a cutting torch and I cut this thin sheet metal with the cutting torch. You have a lot of slag here and you gotta really grind all this crap down. So we're gonna see if the, if this uh, plasma cutter really makes a difference. I got this little welding table at um, Northern Tool. It's called Clutch. It's like 200 bucks. It's got all these connectors, um, clamps. We'll see if this works. So I can just take my plasma cutter and connect it to the table. So I think I was wrong. I think this is the final ready to cut piece. I think air is going to come through there and we'll see how it works. I'm going to turn it on. I think that means, whoa. Well, I can tell you this, um, these edges are incredible. Look at this, almost no slag here compared, look at that. I don't, I don't even know what the voltage settings are supposed to be at right now, but uh, look at this just really smooth compared to this amount of slag pretty incredible so I just have to do a little bit of research and then I can probably learn how to use this a little bit better we'll see if I can make something today <laughs>